what are your school's long-term goals for integrating technology into the curriculum and how does this donation fit into that vision? Hi, I am Aniona Jones, principal of the Haile Selassie High School. This donation of 30 computers marks a humongous over $5 million investment into the information technology program here at our school. Now, our students are being prepared for jobs that don't even exist yet, all of which will be technology-based. As a result, these 30 computers will provide those students with an amazing opportunity to be exposed to a number of applications, programs, and of course, the opportunity to see what the world has to offer. You see, here at Haile Selassie High School, many of our students don't necessarily get the chance to interface with technology. And so our school must present them with these amazing opportunities. A $5.3 million investment, humongous leap for our institution. So I'm very happy to be here today at Haile Selassie High School. Of course, our principal is here. Um, years ago, CXC indicated its intention to put this examination online. And at the OEC, we agree that we need to assist the schools to make that a reality. And um, we consulted with the Minister of Finance and got permission to spend some money on computers in the schools. And we have been doing this for the last seven or eight years. We decided to put 30 computers in 180 public schools in Jamaica. We are at the sixth tranche and we are happy to be at Eilis Nasi to present those computers this morning. The computers are and can be used for instructions, although we would like for them to be used for testing, but they can be used for instructions and whatever the schools want to use them for. Um, we're certainly excited that we can donate to Haile Selassie High School. Uh, we know that this is an inner city school where the students sometimes do not have the resources that other schools have. And we are especially pleased that they will be exposed to the use of these computers to enhance their, their learning activities. How do you plan to ensure the long-term maintenance and upkeep of these computers to maximize their lifespan and benefit for the school? All right, so in terms of maximizing the lifespan of the computers, we would normally have our system administrators who would clean the computers, ensure that there's any dust particles on the keyboards, and we will also have our antivirus softwares on each of the computers, as well as we will normally back up our data. How do you see these computers benefiting students who may not have access to technology at home? This computer will benefit the students tremendously. A large number of our students do not have access to devices at home, so they will now be able to do their homework, SBAs, and so forth using the computers. We can now extend the day. We can now ask them to stay for homework sessions so that they can use the device that they do not have in their home environment. Our kids will have an opportunity to catch up with the rest of the world and show that with a little investment, they too can take up their place as Jamaican citizens in the digital age. Yeah.